What's going on guys? Well, I just figured I'd come back and give y'all another uh, review update of the AutoGen jump box. Um, the, this thing has been amazing. Uh, I am very, very impressed. Uh, and if you're looking for a, a good uh, portable jump box on a budget, uh, whenever I bought this uh, several months ago, or I don't know what, two or three months ago, I guess, probably, they uh, got off Amazon, I think it was $179 at that time. I don't know what it is now or what it's going to be whenever you're watching this video, but that's what it was at the time. And like I said, this thing has been amazing. Uh, my trip out to California uh, a couple months ago, uh, Tony had one and uh and it jumped my truck off with two dead batteries i mean just fired it up and um no charging nothing just hook it up and it cranked right up just like it was they was brand new batteries so i immediately ordered one and i have jumped let's see whenever it came in my truck uh before i got the new batteries on my truck it was dead so i jumped it off there uh let's see here i think after and that was straight out of the box that had that was the battery life that it had straight out of the box um then i charged it and i'm, I'm trying to think what else i've jumped off with it uh i'm trying to go in order um i think i jumped my jumped the tahoe off which I just did, and uh, but I jumped it off uh, actually a couple of times before because I got all those radios and lights and everything in there, and um, and even though they're cut off, it's it's still got a draw on the battery. Um, I have jumped the dually off twice, uh, but this last time, uh, since the last time that I have charged it, um, I charged it probably maybe a little over a month ago right at a month maybe just a little bit more uh it's definitely been over a month but it had a full charge i have since then i have jumped the tahoe off i have jumped my dually off um i have in fort myers i done uh the landing gear on the camper because uh, my my camper battery was dead oh uh, let's see yesterday morning uh hooking up uh, i had to use it to get my uh to raise landing gear up on the camper because again my battery was dead same thing when i delivered this morning i had to use it to get unhooked and then let me turn y'all around came out here to the tahoe and sorry i didn't get no video of it but no uh, i don't know i just Honestly, I wasn't thinking it was going to do it, <laughs> but uh, battery on the Tahoe was completely dead, and it was just click, 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 and the reason I didn't think it was going to do it is because, look at that, I only got two bars, so I didn't think it would do it, and all the stuff I've, and all those stuff I've used it on, and, and it hadn't been charged, and in over a month and it jumped the tahoe off so guys let me set this down and then but yeah see like there it is auto gen 12 volt portable jump start uh starter power bank 4500 amps and that's about how big it is right there a little bit longer than the palm of my hand it's about as wide as my hand i mean it's light it's not heavy comes with a nice little case a little rubbery uh even though it's rubbery feeling it, it's still a good solid case i mean if you was to drop it and have you was to run over it then obviously no but comes with instruction manual 
uh, the jumper cables plug them in but yeah guys they um uh, in order to charge it it takes um uh, uh not the newer android but the older android phones uh and uh that type plug that's that's what it uses to charge plug in cigarette lighter um wall at home uh whatever uh it's got a flashlight on it uh three different modes it's got a, a high beam low beam and uh, a flash it's also got a plug where you can uh, plug in like a usb port uh it's got that plug it's also got the like cigarette lighter style plug and I don't know I'm blown away uh, I was skeptical about getting it and uh, cuz I was looking at one Mr. Tennessee have is the the NOCO I think or I think that's what it's called I think I think I'm not sure <laughs> anyway I was thinking about getting that but it's pretty pricey and, it, and it's a very good one too um, and but whenever I saw what it did on my dually with uh, Tony's, then I was very impressed. And uh, so far, I've had it for maybe, like I said, maybe three months, and and it's it's definitely done its job, uh, very very many times. So, um, so if you're looking for a good, uh, I don't want to say cheap, but if you're looking for a good portable jump starter jump box for a cheap price on a budget I highly recommend it um, they I will try well I don't know it will actually do it or not um, as of the time of this video whenever I'm making this video uh, I am not an affiliate of Amazon uh, you can that's where I got it was Amazon uh, later on whenever you're watching this video maybe a few months year down the road by then I may be but as of now I'm not so I'm not getting anything off of this uh, as of the time of this video uh, they did not send me this jump box I paid full price for it I'm just giving you my 100% honest review just like i told you i would um so one thing i'm i am anxious to see um being it cranked up my dually with them two batteries um i am anxious to see with a full charge if it will actually jump a big truck off um Trying to get around here and watch my dogs. They uh let me turn y'all around. Let's see. Is that one right there on the left? That's Semper, that's my search and rescue dog. Uh the one on the right, well the one on the left now, straight ahead, that's Sarge. That's my big boy. Her little bitch ass is in heat right now. And he knows it. And I haven't had a chance to get them, neither one of them fixed. They, uh, she's been doing good. I mean, for the last two times she's been in heat, uh, she ain't like acting like she ain't wanting no part of it. Uh, so she's pretty much kept him off. I'm hoping she continues to do so because I do not want any puppies. Um, they, puppies are just too much of a headache. Now, don't get me wrong. They'll be some beautiful puppies. They will. Because she's a German Shepherd. He's a German Shepherd Malinois, Belgian Malinois mix. So they would be some beautiful puppies. But I just don't want any. <laughs> I ain't got the time to mess with them and all that stuff. And two, yes, I could, if I, if they was born around the, uh, a good time of the year 
then yes, I could probably sell them and and make probably five six hundred dollars a piece off of them. Oh, uh, they and I would love to have a puppy out of the litter. Um, it's just I just don't want to deal with having to take care of the puppy for eight weeks or, or if not longer until they sell. The only other problem is, is Semper, my search and rescue dog, uh, she was actually donated uh, to me um, for the cause of search and rescue. Uh, she was uh, bred by, by a breeder that, that, uh, that breeds German Shepherds for uh, for working line and uh, for like police and search and rescue protection stuff like that so like service dogs oh uh, so she was like a fifteen hundred dollar dog oh uh, but uh the lady i got her from um uh, very thankful that that uh because i called her up never met her before i talked to her on the phone for like an hour and uh and she loves what she does and um uh, uh, of course i had to give her a couple references uh, she actually called uh her husband uh called uh knew one of the guys that i was on the fire department with and called him and asked him, hey what kind of guys is, is this guy and um but so they uh so they donated uh the dog and uh she is akc uh registered but uh, being that she was donated, it was in the agreement that I cannot rebreed her. Um, I can breed her as far as just puppies or whatever like that. They just won't have. They just won't be AKC uh, registered. Sarge, uh, he's not because he's mixed uh, German Shepherd and Malawa. Now I could probably get CKC uh, registered on him, but no, um, I don't know. If it happens, I guess it happens, but I'm not wanting it to happen. So anyway, I then got off topic. Uh, back to the jump box. They, uh, again, uh, I highly recommend it. Uh, make a great late Christmas gift, birthday present. Uh, guys, Valentine's coming up. Uh, Valentine's Day will be here before you know it. Uh, guys, get your wife one to keep uh, keep her in her car. Uh, so that way she won't be stranded. Uh, and uh, ladies, get your husband one if he don't have any if he don't have a jump jump box or jumper cables. Um, get your kids one. Um, I mean, you know how we always want our kids to be out here and be safe and not be stranded on the side of the road for some no good stranger coming up and supposedly wanting to help them and then just let y'all y'all know where that's going it's a shame we can't trust people no more used to i mean people pull over on the side of the road and, and help anybody out now you can't you can't really trust either side. You can't trust the person pulling over to help because then they may abduct you. Uh, you can't really trust the person broke down on the side of the road because they could be faking it and then somebody else is out in the ditch or out in the woods and while you're sitting there changing the tire and they come up and knock you over the head and take everything you got. It's a shame what this world's come to. So... Make that investment in that jump box. Keep your wife and kids safe. Uh, again, I highly recommend it. All right, we're going to get off here. Y'all take care. If y'all don't, uh, again, sorry. If y'all don't mind, y'all like, share, subscribe. Uh, I'm still trying to grow my channel. I uh, appreciate everybody that watches my, my videos and everything that I put out. And, um, um, Everybody that comments and, and everything like that, everybody that subscribed, um, uh, y'all keep passing the word of my channel and everything, so that way I can uh, keep growing and everything. Uh, I'm a long way from it, but 
maybe one day I might start making money with YouTube. Who knows? I might become a millionaire. <laughs> I doubt it, but uh, it don't hurt to wish, does it? <laughs> so, all right. Well, y'all be safe out there. Semper Fi.